I'm only doing high reps right now for the lower body. It's just safer this way, and my legs are getting bigger, so that's all good, right? So uh, uh, I'm gonna show you some tricks, some mental tricks. I'm gonna show you three mental tricks that I do to try to overcome the physicality and the uh, the heaviness of the weights. I wanna make every workout. I try to make the weights seem a little lighter. I'm not going lighter. I just wanna use my mind, use the play the mental game, make them seem a little lighter. The first trick is to divide your reps into different sections. For example, if I'm going for a 20 rep squat, that's a lot of reps, right? If in my mind I'm counting, you know when you do, when you do a set, you always count your reps. And if you count from one to 20, that's very mentally exhausting. And physically, you feel it too. You're like, oh my God, one to 20, that's a lot. It feels like a long journey, a long road to go. But if you can divide that journey into half or into another half, that makes it a lot easier because you move on different phases, uh, different different realm of the, of the lift, you know, you divide that into a section. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do 20 reps of squats, but I'm gonna divide it into three sessions. First, I'm gonna do the first 10 reps to be easier. So I'm okay. I'm okay with 10 reps. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then when it gets harder on the second half of the lift, I'm gonna divide that shit up. So and then I go one, two, three, four, five, and then refresh again, and then go into the, the last room and then just go, I got five more, the last five more. One, two, three, four, five. Okay? Okay, you, you can even divide the last section into three and twos. So if I go 10, 5, and then the last five sets, five reps, it's really, it's really difficult. I can't do it anymore. So one, two, three. Okay, three, two more. Then I got two more. I got two, one, and, one, and then one more. That really makes it, your head thinks it, uh, makes the journey a little bit lighter if you divide into different sections. So you enter different zones. Um, I like to stop. 
like to wait into different variations. I like to create art when I lift, right? Be more creative because, for example, if I want to do 225 on the bench press or on the deadlift, I can put 245s, that's what most people do. We can, we can put 245 plates. But sometimes I want to trick my brain, I want to trick my perception into a shock it a little bit, you know, shift gear. So, um, so as to um, uh, give it a little new stressor to adapt. Right up, right up. See, to me that looks lighter than two plates. You know, I forgot to bring chalk, so I have to use protein shake. It's all again. Yeah, fuck, it sucks when you forgot to bring chalk, man. You gotta use fucking protein shake. Stiff like that lip. So how much you can lift has a lot to do with how much your body perceives or your sensory uh, perceptions perceive that weight to be. So if you always lift 225 with 245 on your side, your body's gonna see that weight and it's gonna have a preconception of how heavy that's gonna be. But if you mix it up a little bit, uh, like I did here, if your body has never seen 245 stacked up this way, it might uh, trick itself into thinking like something lighter and you might just, you know, boost the PR there. Uh, there you go. Look how beautiful that is. Turning weightlifting into aesthetics. In your mind, try to think of the way the world feels mm. when you're on psychedelics. Mm. Just think about how the world, how everything flows, how the weights are just wavy and how the weights are all just spongy and then the, the whole gym is just kind of in, in the palm of your hand, how when you breathe the whole room breathes with you and the weights breathes with you and how it's all wavy and very soft and very light. Just think of how you're the weight, and you're also the weight group, and you're also Arnold, you're also the mm. plate, you're also the part, you just want to the it, everything's connected, you're a beast, you're, you're Papa New Guinea, you're Tom Cruise, and you can lift your fingertips, you can lift everything you so like it's all oh, like inside your head. Oh man, and look what's on the other side. Opposite, oh, this is the power of the opposites. Contrast. That really works. Yeah. <laughs>